first award-winning BBQ with a view. Uh, John Hansen will head to Willis Tower for a taste of Q Barbecue at their brand new pop-up restaurant. We're drooling already. People wow. are lining up. Uh, and that was in the morning hours. So we'll get to that when you and me returns. All right, it is 745. Sweet smells are filling the lobby of Willis Tower all week long. Bib Gourmand winning Q Barbecue is open as a pop-up restaurant there, and John Hansen's here to tell us more about it. It was perfect timing, because you know, yesterday I was up at the dog place on the northwest yeah. side. There wasn't food there. We're so used to food here in the studio. I didn't have anything. And they're like, oh, you're going to go to this pop-up thing? And I was like, okay, fine, yeah. fine, but I'm so hungry. But then they're like, oh, it's Q Barbecue. I was like, oh, yes. I'm doing it. Perfect. Absolutely. It was so good. I got to say, people love good barbecue, obviously. And honestly, by 1030, the line was already so long, but it moves really quickly. It makes sense. Some of their meat is slow cooked. Get this for nearly an entire day. Let's take a look. It makes sense that just off the lobby of one of Chicago's most unique buildings here at the Willis Tower, here we are with Q Barbecue. What are we doing down here? Oh my goodness. Well, we're having a pop-up all week here, and this is just a great event that we brought to the Wacker side of the world's most iconic building. Mm -hmm. And you have such big and bold barbecue flavors with Q Barbecue that we wanted to come right here to Willis Tower. Makes sense. Big and bold, big, big taste, bold. big building. What do we got going on here? What can people get uh, for lunch? So here's what we're serving for lunch. On a brioche bun, we have our pulled pork smoked 12 hours. Ooh. We have our pulled chicken smoked for seven hours. And this is my favorite. This is our beef brisket smoked for 22 hours. Wow. This is the real deal. Wow. And we're bringing it right here to the Willis Tower. That puts my slow cooking to shame, I gotta say, Gina, <laughs> Melissa. Now, the, the big thing, obviously, with any barbecue food, it's all about the sauces. It is, and one thing that I wanted to do at Q Barbecue was give you the uh, opportunity to taste your own sauce. We okay. all have our different flavors. Yeah. So we have our Memphis sweet sauce, which is a lot of brown sugar and really great flavors. Mm -hmm. Off of that, we have our vinegar sauce, you know, in, uh, from the uh, Carolinas. Okay, yeah. And then we have our Texas spicy sauce, which is my favorite. We use bird eye uh, chili pepper in there. All right, we'll call this one, we'll call the sweet one. This is Melissa. Uh, we'll go the spicy, that's Gene. For sure. And I'll be the vinegar. <laughs> sure, why not? I mean, I guess <laughs> if someone has to be. And then, you know, get a side too. This is a complete lunch down here. You're not just coming for a sandwich. It is. So you grab a sandwich, and then we have our signature sides here. We have our four cheese macaroni, which we crumble cheese its on top. Mm -hmm. mm. Wow. We then have our smoked baked beans that we put pork and bacon and other stuff in there. And then we have our creamy yet vinegar coleslaw. It's right in the middle. And then our good old-fashioned cornbread, which was one of my family's secret recipes. All right, so this is a big, bold flavor, a great lunch opportunity. In just a little bit, I'm going to need some of this comfort food. I'm going to need some courage. I've never been on the ledge. It's freaking me out a little bit. We're going to check that out. All right, so we'll be, you're going to come with me, right? I'll come with you, and I'll bring some courage with me. All right. So that is really fun. Yeah, they've got the, the sauce. I mean, that's what makes barbecue, obviously. Mm -hmm, but, true. like, everyone has their own opinion about whether they're uh, Melissa Jean or me sort of mm -hmm. sauce this. Here's sweet. the thing that's funny. I don't, uh, <laughs> even though I like spicy everything. things. Right. And I don't know if you're trying to say I'm spicy. I'm trying to say you're spicy. Trying to say, yeah. well, I don't know what you're trying to say. <laughs> but when it comes to barbecue sauce, I actually don't prefer the spicier uh, okay. stuff. I like the flavor of bar barbecue. I like the smokiness. Mm -hmm. I like the sweetness. And I like all those things that are combination. Mm -hmm. And I find that the heat messes with it. For me. Okay. So I don't actually eat spicy. I think with you, you eat almost all because yeah. everything works yeah. so good. But this is pouring it on there. This was really fun, but we don't know like if they're going to be doing this yeah. pop up it, at Willis. It seemed like a perfect space. They had music I there. It was really idea. cool. Yeah, and I think that what it is is you know a lot of people, uh, you know, Q Barbecue has locations all over. They have one in Lakeview and a couple of the suburbs as well. But you know, you get into this routine when you eat every day downtown, That's true. like what you're doing. So it's a cool thing to like. Try something new. So. I have an idea. I think that Q, uh, that that different people that want to have Q barbecue yeah. come to you know near where they are. Yeah. Uh, uh, ask, ask them to come to their building lobby. <laughs> Let's get a pop up right yeah, here. With Q you got to bid for it. They can sit on the couch and everything. Oh, so I'm going to do the ledge next hour. You need on, on the ledge. Eat on the ledge. Okay. Ah. Bless your little heart. The things you end up doing for you and uh, me. I know.